In recent months, American automakers have had to make hard choices to adapt to economic conditions, workforce reductions, plant closings, and reducing the number of models they offer. But one car General Motors has said it would not cut back on is the Chevrolet Volt. You know, just because General Motors is in the financial struggle of its life doesn't mean they stop everything. And coming out with the Volt in the middle of this is is a very important statement. It's not only we have, you know, we have advanced products, we have advanced technology. We said we were going to make this, we said we could do it, and here it is. GM has had its share of skeptics since it announced its plans to build the Volt. But the automaker has moved forward with its plans for the battery-powered vehicle by building the largest battery test lab in the United States and now producing the first real production intent Volt. Now what we've got are the pre-production vehicles, which is basically what you see here. And this is the Volt. It's got the interior, it's got the exterior, it's got the drive quality. This is what we'll be using for the next number of months to finish the job. There will be approximately 80 pre-production Volts built to test and validate everything from aerodynamics to crash worthiness. GM claims to be ahead of schedule and plans to have the Volt in Chevrolet showrooms by the end of 2010. I'm Chris Hansen.